I finally have purple frog squishmallows. I have some long stories to tell you about how I acquired these purple frogs. They're not actually really that long, but I do want to start off with the first squishmallow I got of 2024. This is Truman, a stackable turtle. What a handsome fellow. Look at this glorious squishmallow. Look at these little legs. Look at this. This is a top tier specimen of a squishmallow. I actually ordered this off Amazon. I don't think I've ever ordered a squishmallow off Amazon before. I saw this on Squish News and there was a link and I went there and it shipped to Australia and before I knew it, I had paid $55 to get this turtle here. <laughs> Now, the first squishmallows I bought in store this year were Valentine's squishmallows. Can you believe that Australia got Valentine's squishmallows before Valentine's Day? I'm used to getting my seasonal squishmallows about two months after the holiday's over. But no, this year EB Games brought out these four lovely squishmallows. So actually six, but I got these four. They are EB Games exclusive. So if you want to get these ones, the only place you can get them is EB Games, unless you live in another country, in which case I have no idea. Let's take a look at each individual one. First of all, we have a whale in a hat. Look at this distinguished gentleman. He's got a top hat, he's got a bow. I would go on a Valentine's date with him. This is the best hat model I've ever seen. Then we've got this beautiful little purple creature. I call it a creature because I have no idea what it is. I think it's some kind of sea creature based on the fact its name is at water and there's water in the name. Wait, anyway, I'm loving the detail on this one. He's got this little shiny pink heart on her head, got the stripy belly, and then we've got embroidered heart cheeks. Heart cheeks are one of my favorite things ever on Squishmallows, so they're so cute. He's got freckles, he's got little pink horns, are these wings, are these fins? I don't know but I love them. Next we have Valentine's Rutabaga. No, nope, its name is Griffith. I really thought this was Valentine's Rutabaga. Well it's not, I shouldn't call caterpillars Rutabaga. This is obviously a different caterpillar. In my defense, these two are both called Rutabaga so I thought we were just calling all insects Rutabaga. I just love these ones so much, like I love how they have like the three distinct different colors. Let's focus on the newest one. Not only does she have the pink, the blue, the dark pink. She has little heart glasses and little cheeks and fluffy antennas. They're like little pom-poms. They're so cute. This is what she looks like from the side and from the back. I really, really love the color combination. This squad just really came through with the designs. Next, we have this beautiful little pink piranha fish. I do this every time. It's not called a piranha. What is it actually called? I'm going to look it up for once. Okay, football fish it is. <laughs> These fins are extra cute because they've got like all these little scallops. The other football fish I have don't have that. Uh. And obviously he has the distinguishing feature, which is the light that the football fish have, but his is a heart. Also, I must shout out this one's bio because it's a top tier bio. It says that Sai, this fish's name is Sai, just launched a line of bioluminescent makeup. A round of applause for an innovator, inspirational fellow. Okay, now we are up to a dream squish. Any purple frog is a dream squish, but this one in particular has heart cheeks and a crown. If you'd asked me a few years ago what my dream squish mellow was, I would have said, I love that frog with heart and I also love the frog with crown. So if they could just combine all of those and make it purple, that would be my dream. Look what they did. Look what they did. Not only did they make this, they brought it to Australia. This was literally just at my local Kmart. She is the perfect shade of purple. I'm literally the same color as her. Now, this design also came out in the clip form. Where is she? Where is she? Such a queen, such a princess. I actually have three of this because when I find clips I like, I like to have one for my collection and one for my bag. I was so attached to this design, I ended up with three. Why won't you sit? Now, aside from getting myself three of this beautiful purple clip, there were also so many other cute Squishmallows in this Valentine's clip squad. I've got Miri, the adorable little moth. She's got a fluffy tummy. She's got the beautiful fluffy antennas and a little sparkly embroidered heart. And then the most beautiful wings. This gradient just gets me every time. It is so pretty. It's going to sit right here. Look at that! She fits in perfectly. We've got Willet, the little orange monster. He's kind of a pinky, orangey, tangerine color and then got the blue and red stripes, the red little puff of hair, and the blue little antlers, and of course, the heart on his eye. He's like the sequel to the Valentine's monster I got last year. Basically the same squishmallow, it's just in different colors. Okay, then how cute is this puppy? Such an adorable one. Can't remember what this breed of dog is called. I hope they make a call you with this little bow because that is just adorable. And the final one I got was this macaron, little pink macaron with some kind of rainbow feeling. I love how it's got this fluff here. It just feels so nice. And then it's got ice 
icing on its head with little hearts. Now, the final two Valentine's Wish I have to show you, I actually got really recently. These were the ones that came out after Valentine's Day. These were the latecomers. They were having a big Valentine's Day party and forgot they were meant to go to stores. So we've got Trinity. I have wanted Trinity for the longest time. It is Trinity with a pizza. It's not the original one, but it is just as beautiful as I always imagined. But her colors, her colors are gorgeous. She looks like very orange on camera, but in real life, it's much more like peach. It's very cute. I love her little Triceratops horns, her little Triceratops frill, and honestly the best part is seeing the little Triceratops hands. They are just so adorable. They've got the little like nails on them. They just look so cute. And then yes, we have the heart pizza with heart toppings on it. Didn't find this squad until March. And then just last week, one week ago, I found this guy. This is the chunkiest five inch I've ever seen. Look at this chunk. Honestly, I think if I measured it, it would be like seven inches. Like it's so big. There's a beautiful a little purple crocodile with a little sparkly purple heart. Anyway, her name is Bunny and she loves cheese. Same! So that is the official ending of the Valentine's haul, but this kind of looks like a Valentine's Squishmallow. This is a beautiful Fuzzmallow Otter. One of the cutest Fuzzmallows I've ever seen. I didn't know this squad was out. I didn't know they were coming to Australia. I had no idea. I walked into a store and I was like, what is that like pastel looking squad in like a big crate? And this squad had so many cute ones, but I'm trying to buy less 12 inch Squishmallows because they take up a lot of space and I'm kind of running out, but I couldn't leave her behind. Her name is Anu. She's an otter. I think I already said that, but I just love the otter's little whiskers and their little freckles. And the pink fuzz was just so nice. So these fuzz melodies, should have said, are from Kmart. With the exception of the EB Games ones, all of them came from Kmart. This came from Kmart. Clips from came from Kmart. Fuzz Mellow from Kmart. Frog from Kmart. Even, oh my gosh, if you keep up with my TikTok, I am losing my mind in excitement because Kmart now sell five inch squishes. Five inch squishes are always my hardest to find. I have so much trouble finding them. Sometimes I will literally check like 10, 20, 30 stores and not be able to find the squad or the individual switch I'm after. It's so frustrating and the five inch ones are so cute and it ends up being this like a few month long hunt but now Kmart sell them so that makes it a lot easier. Having said that, I'm still on the hunt for a red squid that came out last year. Every time I go to Toy World, the whole squad's there, not the red squid. Now it's out at Kmart and every time I've been to Kmart since they started stock five inch, they either don't have the squad or they have the whole squad except the red squid. I just feel like the universe really doesn't want me to have this red squid. Squid. While I've been hunting for my red squid, I have found so many amazing five inch squish bellies. Let me get them all. Oh my goodness. I walked into a Kmart and they had two brand new squads of Easter five inch squishmallows. And at this point, I had never seen five inch squishmallows at Kmart. I had seen them on the website and I was like, is this legit? Are they coming to stores? And I saw them and there were the two boxes sitting on the shelves. And I bought so many, I got to keep one of the purple boxes too. So like, this is from two different squads. They're both meant to be Easter squads. Some of them, I'm kind of not really sure what's Easter about them, but we just roll with it. First up, we have Fritz the frog. Fritz is an interesting frog. It's the first frog I've got that doesn't have like the white embroidery around its eyes. It's embroidery is like, honestly, it kind of looks orange. I think it's meant to be like a red-eyed tree frog. Also from that squad is this little Easter drink. Her name is Suey. She is so cute. Got a little purple flower. She's got sprinkles in her. Got little bunny ears and a little straw. I have no idea what kind of beverage she is. I would have thought that Easter beverages would always be chocolate, but she's not looking too chocolatey. Maybe it's white chocolate. Then the third one I got from that squad is Carolina the carrot. Oh my gosh, this carrot is adorable. She's so cute with her little cheeks and her little eyelashes and her little flower and look at these carrot leaves. So those were all from the one squad. Here are the other members of that squad. Then this squad has got to be one of my favourite squads of all time. One of my favourite things ever, Squishmallows and Outfits. And we've got this beautiful distinguished frog in a bow tie. Loves playing in the rain. He loves having cozy tea parties and he has this corduroy on his stomach. It's just so gorgeous. This bunny is in a hat. It's literally a straw hat. Okay, it's not actually straw. It looks like a straw hat and then it has this band of teal around here that matches his teal bow tie. 10 out of 10. Then we have got, I feel like I've said the joke distinguished gentleman about 20 times already, but this is a distinguished gentleman. He's got a little waistcoat with a plaid bow and glasses. He also has a very cute little tail on the back. And we have this adorable little bird. Okay, I thought this was a bird, but in her tag it says she's a spring chicken, which makes sense with like the Easter theme. I'm not sure how some of those other ones are Easter themed, but whatever. So yes, this is a chicken, which you can kind of tell by her little chicken arms and her little chicken... Anyway, I just thought it was so cute that she had this beautiful pink bow. How adorable is that? And then the final one I got from that squad, this beautiful purple groundhog. How glorious, how wonderful, a purple groundhog wearing a bunny hood. 
This is Javari. I was gonna call it Javari, but I had learned from the rutabaga situation. Just because they're the same creature doesn't mean they're the same name. But no, this one's obviously wearing a bunny hat, but they're both named Javari. Maybe they're twins. So yes, glorious five inch Easter squishes, glorious five inch Easter squishmallow box. Let me show you all the other Easter squishmallows I have got, because there's been quite a few. I don't think I bought enough seven inch squishmallows this time round. It, these are important squishmallows though, okay? It's a frog in overalls. The overalls have a literal pocket that you can literally put a tiny squish fill in. Somebody told me to do this on TikTok. This is the first time I've actually done it. I just remembered. <gasps> Nothing gets better than this. So I got Baratelli. Then I also got on that day, the first day I found the overall squad, I got Carolina. Once again, she has the lovely overall details and she has a bunny on her pocket. The pocket is openable. Now these Squishmallows, so far I've only seen them at kid stuff. So these were the two I bought the first time I saw the overall squad. A few weeks later, I found my bunny. She is so cute. She also has a little pocket, but her pocket doesn't have embroidery for some reason. I'm not sure, maybe because she has this extra flower up here. She didn't need the details here. But what is extra cool is these are like a set. These are like an adorable set of three because you see we've got orange and then the frog has the orange overalls and then we've got green frog and the bunny has green overalls and then we've got grey bunny and the carrot has grey overalls. So they're just like the perfect little trio. I actually also got one more of the overalls. She doesn't match the set, but she's an Avery. She's a duck. I don't really collect Averys, but my little sister loves ducks. And it just reminds me of her. And I'm sorry, this Avery is winning in the style department. A yellow hat with a little flower on it and matching yellow overalls. Thank you for your services, Avery. You are beautiful. Okay, some other Easter squishmallows I got. A carrot cake. This carrot is called Scooter. He is also an elevator inspector, just if you were wondering. So I now have a lot of carrots. I have a carrot cake, a carrot in overalls, and a five inch carrot plus the four inch carrot I already had. I wonder why Squishmallows are going so hard on the carrot designs. Are they trying not to promote chocolate visa? And they're like, here, have a carrot instead. It's not working because now it's just made me emotionally attached to carrots and now I don't want to eat any. Although this bunny is eating a carrot. Not gonna lie, these carrots are a little bit frightened of her. Final Easter Squishmallow I have to show you is this Squishmallow. Now, if you know me, you probably think, oh my gosh, it's a purple Squishmallow with a flower crown. It's got sparkles on it. That must be a dream Squishmallow. I love the flower crown. I love the sparkly ears. I love the fluffy belly, but something about this tongue, I'm just not vibing with it. I don't know why I find it so off-putting. This should be the cutest Squishmallow, but every time I see it, I'm just like, I don't like how her expression looks. I just think it would be so much cute without the tongue. So my vision is I'm going to get her like a carrot or a little chocolate egg or something and customize her to be eating something and put that over the tongue. Moving on. Now the rest of these fellows are from the unseasoned crew. They have no theme. They're just all those Squishmallows I found that were beautiful. Starting with this one, I've been looking for this one since late last year. This is a flip mellow. It's a beautiful pink monarch butterfly and then is quite the wrestling match. It turns, oh, I should have done it the other way. I should have shown you, wow, this is a beautiful rutabaga to add to my rutabaga collection. What, she's evolving? She's transforming? Your Pokemon has evolved. I'm so obsessed with the details on the Monarch Butterfly's wings. They're just so cute. Okay, then I found this. This was so random. They might have really been like pumping out the seven inch squads. I can't even keep up with them. I go in and I see like a whole crate of seven inch Squishmallows. I don't know who's from what squad. There's just a whole lot of ones I haven't seen before, which includes this lovely dolphin. Did I call this a whale? <laughs> It's definitely a dolphin. It is a dolphin and it is my only dolphin. In all my years of squish collecting, I've never bought a dolphin. I don't know if I've ever even seen a dolphin or maybe I just saw like the plain original version and it didn't like excite me. But this one has a surfboard and it also has sparkly sunglasses. Also from the random new Kmart squads with these two beautiful fellows. So we've got another Ludwig. No, it's Robert. I will never understand which teal frog is Ludwig, which teal frog is Robert. They look exactly the same. Maybe they're just twins. Maybe that was the answer the whole time. Then we've got Gordon the shark with a beautiful little bow tie. Um, extremely adorable. So, so cute. He's gonna look so good on the Gordon shelf because the Gordon shelf is already grey and blue and he just really fits in. So this new mystery brunch squad or breakfast squad. Oh no, I think it's a dessert squad. I did a little opening on my TikTok and I think I put it on shorts. But normally my approach with getting mystery squishes is I try to look through the holes and like see what colors on the bottom, see what color would be on the bottom so I can get the ones I want. That didn't work this time because the two ones I wanted were this little s'more and this little ice cream and they both had like a light brownie color on the bottom. So I needed to become creative. And I remember the last time I posted mystery bags, I was searching for the orange juice one and someone was like, you could have just felt for the straw. And I was like, oh my God, that is the smartest thing anybody has ever said in my life. So I took that advice and I was feeling around for the cherry on the ice cream, feel around for like a little ropey bit. 
it. And then the other one I wanted was a small, so I was feeling around for the bow and I was successful. Now I've got these two adorable little friends in my collection. I love how this is a purple ice cream. I don't think I've ever done a purple ice cream before or I've never seen one and so I'm really obsessed with it. This is my latest Squishmallow, this beautiful purple moth. I love her little cheeks, I love her eyelashes and all her little red accessories. And she also has a fuzzy belly, so she's a lovely one to hug. Also interesting that came out now have 14 inch Squishmallows. Unfortunately, they're still charging the same as 16 inch Squishmallows, which brings me to the 16 inch Squishmallow I bought. That is a frog. This is another dream squish. Any purple frog squish is a dream squish, but this one is 16 inch. I have dreamed of hugging a giant purple frog my whole life. She also has spots on her back. Look how beautiful. And the funniest thing is this Squishmallow, her name is Philomena and I read her tag and was like, oh, she's running for mare. And then the reason she's running for mare is because she thinks that everybody should get more sleep. She's a big fan of siestas, big fan of naps. So she's running for mare to make uh, midday naps mandatory. I often have a midday nap. You know where I nap? On my purple couch. My purple couch that is the exact same shade of purple as this frog. It looks like she's a cushion from the couch. She really just fits right in to promote the napping agenda to me specifically because I always want to nap on this couch. Anyway, that was a lot of talking. Thank you so much for sitting through this long video. Thank you so much for sitting through my Squishmallow collection video, which I did a few weeks ago, a month ago. Where does the time go? Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye!